Hi hey guys, and welcome to a short Blender tutorial tip. And what we're going to be doing here is subtracting geometry. So we're going to be able to subtract one object from another. So here's our basic primitive cube here. And let's say we wanted to create a curve in um, the middle of this. So we want to cut out a curved shape. What we'll do is go to create, and we'll create a cylinder. Um, we're going to rotate this on the x-axis 90 degrees, so R, X, and 90. We'll scale it on the y-axis to make it a little bit bigger. Now we're done with that, we're going to go to our front view, and we will place this like so, and we'll go then to our right view, make sure it sticks out. Okay, so now we're done with that, we will select our cube, and we'll open up our modifiers and we're going to add a boolean modifier and from the list we select difference and we're going to then get the eyedropper and we'll select our cylinder so now that will um, subtract the difference between the cylinder and the cube so if we hit apply and X to delete our cylinder you'll see that we now have the curve in our cube so that is how, how the uh, Boolean modifier works. So we'll just go back. It, you could also do it the other way around, of course. You could select the um, cylinder, add a Boolean modifier, difference, the eyedropper, select our cube, apply this, and now when you move the cube out of the way, you'll see that it's cut out the... Um, cylinder there. So these two parts now would actually fit together or you could delete the cube and just have this, this shape that's left. Um, so you could do multiple extra, um, um, intersections so we could create another object so let's create a, um, a sphere So now we've created that sphere, I'm going to scale it down a little bit. I will select the cube, add modifier, boolean, difference, we select cylind um, the sphere, apply, and then we can delete the sphere and we have the whole inside of our cube there. So that is basically how the Boolean modifier works using the difference option. Um, you can also apply, instead of difference, you could have union. So we'd select the cylinder, uh, the sphere, hit apply, and that will join together now those two objects. So we can delete our original object, and you'll see that it's basically done the opposite. Um, instead of subtracting it, it's joined these together. And it creates all of the mesh for us, so you don't have this unnecessary uh, hidden faces which um, further complicate the model. So that is basically how the Boolean modifier works. I hope you found this tutorial useful. Please hit the like button if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to keep up to date with all of our latest tutorials, tips, and hints here for Blender.